Hi guys. Um, apologies for my appearance. Still a little leftover fun from surgery. Um, but I just wanted to make a video because I thought it would be easier for you guys to kind of like understand and navigate what's going to go on the next couple of weeks. Um, so basically for most of us, it's going to be business as usual. Um, with the exception of ceramics. So if you're in photo, we're going to continue what we were going to do. If you are in studio or you're in um, graphics, we're going to continue what we were going to do because we have the resources to be able to do it. Um, so that's good news. Um, a couple of you guys have assignments that are outstanding and I will update the due dates for those on Classroom and you'll just make sure you submit your work via Classroom. Um, for those of you who may not have the equipment or materials that you need, um, I do believe that they are going to allow you to go to school to grab what you need. Um, so if you left your camera in your locker, you're gonna, you're gonna be able to go up and get your camera from your locker. Um, if you have capability, of uploading your pictures to a computer at home from the cord that's in the front pocket of your camera case, um, you're going to use your camera um, for your assignments. If you have no way of being able to do that, um, then you're, you'll be able to use your phone um, to complete your assignments. It's not ideal, um, but it's, it's what we're gonna do for now because this is not ideal situation. Um, Graphics, most of you have your iPads at home. Um, if you listen to the instructions I gave you before I left for my surgery, um, then you have your iPad at home, which is awesome. The few of you, I checked the case earlier, I stopped in at school, um, who don't have your iPads at home, it's gonna be a little trickier for you and a lot less interesting. Um, so um, I'm gonna have an alternative for you guys. Um, but basically, my graphic students, you're going to finish up the outstanding things that we had going on, and then we'll do another um, assignment after that to bring us to our two-week mark when we get back to school, um, hopefully. Um, but yeah, so basically, what I'm going to do is um, I will have office hours in the morning. You guys know I have little kids, so um, the easiest thing for me to do would be to get up early before them and before my husband has to work from home um, to be available to you guys. So um, so my office hours are going to be from seven to nine in the morning. So I'll be available on Google Meet um, to do office hours for you guys then. So if you need like one-on-one -on -one advice or you want me to look at your work, um, that's when I will be available online. Um, but then also I'm going to set up a remind for all of you to be able to look at. Um, and then you can message me anytime on remind. Um, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Like I said, I'm, I'm going to be juggling a lot since my kids are going to be home with me now. So, um, but I, you guys know, um, from the past, I'm pretty good at getting back to you pretty fast on remind. Um, so we'll have remind. And then um, also you'll be able to email me. So um, I will check my email every day when my kids go in for their naps. So um, at three o'clock, which is after school hours, but you can, you can email me during. Um, um, and I will get back to you in the afternoon. Um, but aside from that, we're gonna try our best to do business as usual. Everything will be up on Classroom. I'm going to ask that you're really good at checking your emails and staying on top of getting on there and um, doing what you're supposed to do. Uh, we're going to go forward like this is our new normal um, and that this is how we're going to do things. Um, hopefully it'll be two weeks. Uh, we don't know. Um, but it's important for us to all stay home and do our part. So um, if you have any questions, you can feel free to email me or use a remind code that I'm giving you um, to shoot me a text, okay? Um, and that's really it. Be well.